Once upon a time, in a bustling mice village nestled within the heart of a vast meadow, lived a community of mice who had one common enemy that instilled terror in their tiny hearts, the cunning and fearsome cat. The cat's presence loomed over the mice like a dark cloud, and they lived in perpetual fear of its deadly claws that could snatch them away from life at any moment. The mice had grown weary of their constant state of anxiety, and they knew that they must devise a plan to outwit the cat or forever live under its ominous shadow. One moonlit evening, the mice gathered in a quiet corner of their underground warren for an urgent meeting. Their tiny whiskers twitched with apprehension as they huddled together, seeking a solution to their predicament. They realized that they needed to devise a way to anticipate the cat's arrival, giving them the precious moments they needed to flee to safety. Many ideas were proposed during the meeting, each mouse fervently sharing their thoughts on how to outsmart their adversary. Some suggested setting traps or creating decoy mice to confuse the cat, while others pondered building hidden tunnels for swift escapes. However, no matter how creative the solutions were, they all had a fatal flaw that rendered them ineffective. The mice despaired as the weight of their problems seemed hopeless. Just as hope began to wane, a small and youthful mouse named Milo stood up amidst the crowd. His eyes sparkled with determination as he cleared his throat and addressed his fellow mice. Friends, he began, his voice quivering with a mix of nerves and excitement. I believe I have a plan that might free us from the clutches of the cat. It's a simple idea, but I have faith that it will work. Curiosity peaked. The mice turned their attention to Milo. He continued, What if we were to hang a bell around the cat's neck? That way, whenever the cat approaches, the bell would ring, and we would have time to flee before it could catch us. A ripple of astonishment spread through the assembly, as the mice exchanged glances, wondering why they hadn't thought of such a straightforward idea themselves. Joyful murmurs of agreement echoed through the chamber, and the mice reveled in the optimism that Milo's proposal brought. Amidst the jubilation, an elderly mouse named Eldrick, known for his wisdom and experience, slowly rose to his feet. His grizzled fur and wise eyes carried an air of authority that commanded attention. The mice fell silent, their ears pricked to catch his words. I must say, young Milo, Eldrick began, his voice carrying the weight of years, your plan is indeed ingenious. It offers us a way to detect the cat's approach and avoid danger. However, I must pose a single, crucial question that we must address before we can fully embrace this idea. Who among us will bell the cat? The assembled mice fell into contemplative silence. Eldrick's question cut through the euphoria like a sharp knife, exposing the practicality that must accompany any plan. The room buzzed with uncertainty as the mice grappled with this new dilemma. Milo's hopeful expression dimmed slightly, and he cast his eyes downward in thought. Eldrick's question was a reminder that while an idea might be brilliant in theory, executing it in the face of danger was an entirely different matter. Days turned into nights as the mice debated the practicality of their predicament. Discussions were heated, and many mice grew frustrated with the lack of a clear solution. Eldrick, in his wisdom, continued to counsel the mice, guiding them to think critically about the challenges they faced. In a quiet corner of the warren, Eldrick and Milo found themselves deep in conversation one evening. The gentle glow of fireflies illuminated their faces as they spoke. Milo, Eldrick began kindly, your idea was a stroke of brilliance. But remember, every plan requires not just innovation, but also the bravery to put it into action. We must find a way to overcome this obstacle if we are to achieve our goal. Milo looked up at Eldrick, his eyes now filled with a newfound determination. Eldrick, I have been thinking, what if we work together as a community to bell the cat? Individually, we might be too small and vulnerable, but as a group, 
we could achieve the impossible. Eldrick's whiskers twitched in approval as a smile crept across his face. Milo, that is the spirit we need. Unity and collaboration can overcome even the most daunting challenges. If we are willing to stand together, I believe we can make your idea a reality. Inspired by their conversation, Milo and Eldrick rallied the mice together for another meeting. This time, the atmosphere was different, charged with a sense of purpose and unity that had been absent before. The mice shared their fears, their uncertainties, and their determination to see their plan through. As a united force, the mice began crafting a plan to put their ingenious idea into action. They gathered materials, designed a bell contraption, and practiced the art of stealthy maneuvering to approach the cat. It was not without its challenges, and there were moments of doubt, but their shared commitment propelled them forward. Finally, the day arrived when the bell was ready, and the mice stood before the cat's lair, their hearts pounding. Eldrick, with his experience, had devised a strategy that would allow them to approach the cat while it slept soundly. With calculated breath, the mice executed their plan with precision, carefully affixing the bell to the cat's collar. As the bell clicked into place, the mice held their collective breath. The sound was both a triumph and a testament to their perseverance. Cheers erupted among the mice as they watched the cat stir and then awaken, its eyes narrowing as it realized the intrusion. In a heartbeat, the cat leaped to its feet, its predatory instincts flaring. The bell jingled and the mice scattered in all directions, their nimble bodies disappearing into the shadows. The cat gave chase, but the ringing bell was a constant reminder of its failure to catch even a single mouse. Days turned into weeks, and the mice began to regain their confidence. The cat, weighed down by the bell and the incessant jingling, was no longer the terrifying spectre they had once feared. It had become a source of amusement and a symbol of their collective resilience. The mice no longer hid in their warrens. They danced in the moonlight, their tiny forms moving with joyous abandon. Milo and Eldrick stood side by side, watching the spectacle with pride. The simple idea that had sprung from Milo's imagination had transformed their lives and their village. And so, the story of the mice and the bell became a legend passed down through generations as a reminder that even the most daunting challenges can be overcome through ingenuity, unity, and unwavering determination. The lesson endured that while it is one thing to propose a solution, it is the collective effort and bravery of a community that can truly bring that solution to life.